Hello everybody, this is No Blind Devs, and today I'm going to be running the Table of Squares program for the Witch Dashi. So let's begin with copying everything in. Table 2. And then Table 3. And let's run it! So what it's doing is it's adding certain values to stores right now, and it's switched over to tape 2 So this tape runs on a loop until it decides to stop, and it will basically create squares, as you can see right here, and right here. That is the original, that is the squared. So as you can see, it works pretty well. I have to thank my buddy David Anders, aka Purple Plague, for his help on fixing all the bugs, <laughs> because I could not do it without him. So as you can see, it will run for a long time. So it'll run for a while and I will cut to when it is done because it basically does the same thing over and over again until it gets to a certain number. So I will cut and I will be right back. Also note that this is way faster than the actual witch, but this is because it would take five hours to compute some programs on the real witch. I'm pretty sure we'll release a version with accurate timing, but <laughs> we're not gonna do that for the regular education branch, that's for sure. And there we go, it is officially stopped at 0 0.11, and as you can see, it's a great program. It does exactly what it's designed to do. It does take a little while, of course, on the modern day computers, assuming you're not running this emulator, it would probably take less than a millisecond because that's how fast they are. Because your computer is about two gigahertz. Okay, two gigahertz is two billion times per second or two billion hertz. So that would be less than a millisecond, because remember, milla, no actually it would be exactly one millisecond, or half a millisecond even. That is how slow the witch was, except I made it faster because not all of us have the time to wait five hours for a computation to be made. Well anyways, thank you for watching. Bye, bye, bye bye bye!